Sabakatea Hawa, Rakatea O'Shea, Barakatea Hawa, Barakatea O'Shea, Barakatea Hawa, Barakatea O'Shea. First and foremost, I want to give our praises and honor and glory to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh. Bashem, Kaka Kodash, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule by the bread and stone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akims in the folk on the earth to push the gospel in sincerity and judge Shalom. Right, this um is not a dish of spiritual food, right? And this topic gonna be this lesson, select this lesson gonna be uh about you know the most I only show his word to the children of Israel. Right? The most I didn't show his word to this other heathen nation. Right? Um you can start with Psalms one forty seven verse nineteen. He who is Yahweh by Shem Shai, the father, right, the name is Yahweh, the son name is Yahweh Shai. There's a true Hebrew name, right? He said he showed he showed his word unto Jacob, which is our food father, right? His statutes and his judgment unto Israel. So Israel is our food father's name changed from Jacob to Israel, which Israel is uh in the Hebrews Yasharala, and it means he, Yami he, right? Um Shar me Prince and Allah me power, Yashar Allah. He prince of the power, or he prince of God, right? Verse um, 20, he had not dealt so with any nation, so he didn't deal so with any other nation. He didn't show no other nation his words, right? He said, and as for his judgment, they have not known them. Praise he the Lord, the Ahab Hashem, So these the other nations don't have this, don't have this wisdom. Right, wisdom, knowledge, and the son of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. Right, this word was only shown unto Jacob, you know, and the elect. Right, uh, so the elect out, out of the nation of Israel have this knowledge, which is the 144,000. Right, have this knowledge. It said the 144,000 is only them can sing this song, right, which is which is the wisdom, knowledge, and the son of the scriptures, and the one third can believe on the on the 144,000, they can believe on these men that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh set up. But this lesson is that the most I only dealing with the nation of Israel, which is you so called Negroes, Latin, Native American Indian, and you only show your word unto you. Right? So you are the hidden nation who, who are claiming the Bible, you know, holding on to our book, claiming it, 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 it referred to you too. You're gonna be judged by those same laws in the, in the Bible, because y'all is a bunch of imposters, and you so-called white people, you know y'all destroy, destroy our records, y'all destroy our Bible, in the time of 70 AD, with Antio Antiochus Epiphanes, you Edomites, then also you have the Bible destruction group, right? So you you you, you devil, this world was given to you devil, right? So are you are you heathens, you know, who learn this Bible claiming that it referred to you? You are gonna be judged by these laws, right? In the Bible, right? It wasn't given to you heathens, right? Um this is Baruch chapter three. I'm gonna start from verse twenty three. Right, then I'm gonna jump I'm gonna start from verse twenty two and I'm gonna jump I'm gonna jump around. Right? He said um he said it had not been here of in Canaan talking about wisdom, right? Canaan go back to these Hamites. Neither had it been seen in Timon. Timon is a grandson of Elipaz, right? This no Salaki, the son of Elipaz, grandson of Isa, right? This Timon is you so called white people. But when the he said the Agar, the Agarines go back to the go back to the the so called Africans that seek wisdom upon the earth. The merchandise, the merchandise of Miran and of Timon, the author of fables. So all this, these uh, doctrine that these nations push, like the Hamites, the Edomites, the Ishmaelites, all these doctrine that pushes fables, it's lies. You understand? It's lies. So you, you, you heathens who wanna claim the Bible that they refer to you all too. They are going to be judged by the laws in the book of the Lord, right? He said, the Agarines that seek wisdom upon the earth and the merchandise of Miran and of Timon, the author of fables, 
and and search us and search it out of understanding none of these have known the way of wisdom nor remember our past and none of these people don't have it you understand none of these people you understand so let me go down to um i think it's the last um um uh, yeah Right, it's um, uh, start from verse 25, Baruch chapter 3, verse 25. He said, This is our power, Yahweh, and there shall none other be accounted of him in comparison, accounted of him in comparison of him. Right, he had found out all the way of knowledge and had given it unto Jacob, his servant. And to Israel is beloved. They understand. So this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the Heavenly Father, the Bible, it was given unto Jacob. Right? It was given unto you, so called Negroes, Latins, and Native American Indian. They understand? It wasn't given to these other Eden nations. These other Eden nations have no business with our Bible. They understand? They have no business with it. It tell you, it tell you, um, uh, um, the, especially these um, these Edomites, right? Let me get the record when it was destroying our Bibles, right? Let me get it, right? First Maccabees one and um, to show that it was it was Edomites. Let me start for one. He said this is um, First Maccabees chapter one verse one, and it happened after that Alexander son of Philip the Macedonian who came out of the land of Chetin and smitten Darius the king of the Persian, Persian and Medes, that he regained in his seat the force over Greece. So this is you Edomites, right? So what you Edomites, you Edomites destroy our records and put us to death when they find us with the Bible, right? And this is a straight cut to you, these, these, these coons out there who send the so-called white man write the Bible, right? There is a bunch of dumb niggas, right? There are a bunch of degenerate. The most I reject you niggas because well, you niggas wicked and refuse to act unto Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. That's why you blind you niggas. Right? Um, you want to give the so called white man the most high glory? Most I can put your niggas to death as a bunch of fools. Right? This is um, Forrest Maccabees. Alright? Let me see. Get straight to the point. Right? Good. This is uh first Maccabee chapter um one verse fifty six. And when they had rent the pieces of the book, right? This is these Edomites, they rent me to tear. And when they had rent the, in pieces the book of the law, which is the Bible, which they which they found they burn them with fire, right? And this is the so-called white man destroying our destroying our record, which is the Bible, destroying our 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 last statutes and commandments, which is in the Bible, right? They destroying it, right? Verse the seven, and whosoever was found with any any the book of of the testament, with testament go back to covenant, or if any committed to the law, the king's commandment was that they should be should should put him to death so this is exactly what's going on so all you want to say the so-called white man write the book right thus did they by their authority unto unto the israelites every month to as many as were found in the city yes yeah, so that they bring the destroyer of record the destroyer of bible if it would found with the bible it was it would be put to death you understand? So now you heathens want to hold on to this Bible. You so-called white people call yourself Christian want to hold on to the Bible. You're going to be judged by these laws. Right? You're going to be judged by these same laws. Right? Um, let me get the next one here. Right? You, you devil's going to be judged by these same laws. Right? These laws wasn't given to you devil. Right, this word was this word was only given to Jacob. Right? 
This is a uh, second Ezra chapter three verse thirty six. Right. Um, I think I should. I think I should start. Uh, all right. This is a. Uh, Start from verse 24. Second Ezra chapter 3, verse 24. He said, Weigh thou therefore our wickedness, and he said, Weigh thou therefore our wickedness now in the balance, and they also that dwell in the world, that dwell, dwell, that dwell, that dwell the world, that the world, and so shall thy name nowhere be found but in Israel. Oh, when was it, Slaki, or when was it? that they which dwell upon the earth have not sinned in thy sight, or what people have so kept thy commandment. Thou shalt find that Israel by name hath kept thy precepts, but not the heathens. Right? You understand? So this word was given to the Israelites. Right? These other nations is brute beasts. Right? This word was given to the Israelites. You understand? Only to the Israelites. And it's not, um, it's, I think it's um, 50, I think 16, right? This was only given to the Israelites, all right? Um, it's Psalm um, 50, um, so I can kind of move a little slowly. Yeah, this this word was this word was only given to the Israelites, right? Um, yeah, this is Psalms fifty four sixteen. But unto the wicked, this is you so called by the wicked. The power said, "What hast thou to do to declare my statutes, or thou shouldest take my covenant in thy mouth, seeing thou hatest instruction and casteth my words behind thee?" They understand, so they hate instruction. So they don't follow, they're not going to follow the ways of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. The ways of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai is harder. Right? And give laws how it's supposed to run and govern the earth. And they don't follow those laws. You understand? So these words wasn't given to these Edoms. Alright? And these Edomites. Right? So this is straight cut. Right? This word was only showing to Jacob, his beloved. Right? Um, Psalms. Right? Um, Psalms 105. Alright, let me start for one. Uh, let's skip two. Right? This is Psalms 105, verse 1. He said, O oh, give thanks unto the Lord Yahweh, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the people, who people among Israel. Like we tell Ezra, um, Ezekiel, eat this roll and go to the house of Israel. Right? Teach the house of Israel. So this word was given only to Israel. Right? This is not for you heathens. Right? This is, um, Jonathan 4 6. Right? He said, Oh, he, he said, Oh, he seed of Abraham, his servant, he children of Jacob, his chosen. He is the Lord, Yahweh, our power, his judgment are in all the earth. That's why we see now this, um, uproar the people are these different disaster these the, these killings is the most high playing out his judgment right verse verse 8 he had remembered his covenant forever the word which he commanded to a thousand generation which covenant he made with abraham and his oath unto isaac and confirmed the same unto jacob for a law and to Israel for an everlasting covenant. You understand? So this word was showing to only the Israelites. Right? Only the Israelites. Right? So get it in your thick skull. This was only for the Israelites. Right? Are you impostors going to be destroyed? Are you heathen nation who become the Bible claiming that you know, these words referring to you, you're going to be judged by these words. 
right? Y'all is a bunch of y'all is a bunch of fucking imposters, right? And you wicked niggas who want to discredit the Bible and say the so called white man write the Bible, yo, most I can destroy y'all, right? Wisdom, uh, Ecclesiastes chapter 24, verse 1. He said, Wisdom shall praise herself and shall glory in the midst of our people. And who's that? Israelites. Right? Wisdom is the word of Yahweh Hashem, Yahusha. Yahusha is that wisdom. Yahusha is the word. These scriptures is the word of Yahweh Hashem, Yahusha, which is wisdom. Right? So, wisdom shall glory in the midst of his people, which is the Israelites. Right? Let me jump to verse 8. Right? He says, um, says, so the creator of all things give, give me a commandment. This is wisdom. So the creator of all things give me a commandment. And he that made me caused my tabernacle to rest and said, let thy dwellings be in Jacob and thine inheritance in Israel. Right? So this word was given unto uh, the Israelites. The Bible is, is, the, Bible is the Israelite book, our record, our last statutes and commandment. You understand? The covenant that the Most High make with us, the two covenant, the first testament and the second testament, which is the first covenant and the second covenant. Right? This has nothing to do with you heathens. Right? This is um, the verse 24, Ecclesiasticus chapter 24, verse 24. No, Salakim like verse 23. He said, All these things are the book of the covenant of the Most High power. Even the law which Moses commanded, commanded for an heritage unto the congregation of Jacob. It was given unto Jacob. Right? It was given unto Jacob. It wasn't given to you other either nation. Right? You understand? It wasn't given unto you other. It was given unto Jacob. Right? And all you dumb niggas who want to say the so called white man write the Bible, you, you, you Israelites. You reprobate, most are gonna destroy you niggas. You understand? Like they said, it's a white man book. Dumb niggas. White man tell you to say that, teach you that. Alright? This is Baruch chapter 4, verse 1. He said, This is the book of the covenant of Yahweh and the law. That enjoyed forever, all they that keep it shall come to life, but such as leave it shall die. And these you Israelites, you understand? They're gonna die if they don't keep it. And the ones that keep it is life, they're gonna come to life. Right? He said, Turn thee, O Jacob, the Israelites, you so can Negroes, Latin, Native American, Indian, and take hold of it, walk in the presence of the light, which is which is which is the truth thereof. That thou mayest be illuminated. Give not thy honor to others. You giving this honor and saying the so-called white man write this book. Ah, you want to say everybody could be saved, it don't matter what nation. The Bible says everybody. No, it's, this book is only for the Israelites. It said, Give not thy honor to others, nor things that are profitable unto thee to a strange nation. O Israel, happy are we, for the things that are pleasing to Yahweh are made known unto us. The things that please unto Yahweh, don't be a faggot, right? You understand? Don't walk, don't 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 eat abominable food. Don't worship these idols. He tell me, he tell he tell me what not to do. You understand? He said, keep the Sabbath that is pleasing unto Him. He said, keep the the Passover that is pleasing unto Him. He said, love thy neighbor as thyself, which is your brother. The please not to him. You understand? He said, he said, he said, deal with um dwell, dwell, dwell with judgment. That's please not to him. You understand? Etc. etc. So he said, Oh Israel, happy are we for the things that are pleasing to Yahweh are made known unto us. You understand? So you 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 niggas are gonna be destroyed. Who want to discredit the Bible? They are going to be destroyed. It's so destruction too. Bunch of dumb niggas. Only one. Only got liberty to run the mountain dark shit. Alright? 
This is um, Second Ezra chapter two, verse fourteen. No, Salaki. Second Second Ezra chapter fourteen, verse forty-two. Salaki. All right. Second Ezra chapter fourteen, verse forty-two. All right. It said, the highest give understanding unto the five men. This is the five men that Ezra, um, the most I command him to bring, right? And this is the men, along, along with Ezra, you know, they were writing these books, right? We're going into it. He said, the highest give understanding unto the five men, and they wrote the wonderful vision of the night that were told, which they knew not. And they sat forty days and wrote in the day, and at night they eat bread. As for me, I speak in the day, and I held not my tongue by night. In forty days they wrote two hundred and four books. And it came to pass, when the forty days were filled, that the highest speaks, saying, The first that thou hast written, publish openly, that the worldly and unworthy may read it. Right, and this this is the Israelites. But keep the seventy last that thou mayest deliver to them only to such as be wise among the people among the Israelites. For in them is the spring of understanding, the fun the fountain of wisdom, and the stream of knowledge. And I did so. Right? So this word was only given to the Israelites. Right? It wasn't given to all these other nations, only the Israelites, you know. And with that, Obis Lesson is edifying. I want to give all praises and honor and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahushai, Ba'ashem Rakakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well at Great Millstone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akiyams and the folk on the earth to push in the gospel and sincerity in truth. Shalom. 144.